So ahead of the final massive event of the year in the Paris Masters, Yannick Sinner has actually pulled out of the event. Let's go have a look at why he had to actually pull out because he's come out on social media and talked about it. This is what Sinner had to say over on Paris Masters socials. I came very early to prepare, then felt sick. I have a virus at the moment, which is going to pass the next two or three days. Body-wise, I'm not ready to compete. I'm very sorry for that. There you have it. Yannick Sinner not playing in Paris, which doesn't really matter. He doesn't need to play Paris. Of course, he has all the points in the world that he's gotten this year, and he's also number one in the world. He's already wrapped that up after winning in Shanghai. And he's got the ADP Finals coming up in a couple weeks' time, which he will be the favorite for. But he won't be playing the Paris Masters, which means Alcaraz, the number two seed, is the best player in the draw. Of course, Djokovic isn't there. We know that as well. Medvedev, Zverev, they're there at the moment. But let me know down in the comments below. Who's going to win Paris now that Sinner's not there? Because he was the indoor favorite, or he was the very much the favorite of this event. Is Alcaraz going to get now get the win because he's been pretty good lately? Or is Medvedev or Zverev, you know, pretty good on indoor courts? Are they going to get the win in Paris now that Sinner's out of the way, but Yannick Sinner not going to be playing in this event. We'll see him in the ADB Finals in a couple weeks' time.